Good morning, guys. It is Miss Philly. What is up? It is Friday and um, we're thrifting alone. Not a lot, just alone. <laughs> because uh, as I talked about in yesterday's video uh, a bit, the problems with my car. Yeah. I was going to trade it in, but then I couldn't trade it in because there's a lot of things to get fixed on it. So then they wanted a down payment. I was like, I didn't give it no freaking motherfucking down payment on no car. I've never given a down payment on a car ever in my life. So I ain't going to start now. Um, so yeah, so it didn't work out with the Nissan, which I'm okay with anyway, because I, I wasn't completely like loving the car and there was like things that were like going on. So it was like, you know, but, um, and you know, the whole not having a car payment for a year really is appealing to me. So I don't know for right now, we are, we are stuck with our Honda, but this Honda needs a complete makeover because there's a lot of things that need to be fixed, like wheel bearing, ball joints, tire rod. It is endless. Like, I don't even know where I'm going to like start. Um, I'm going to ask my mechanic, which one is more important because I, I don't have all that money, but yeah, I'm going to guess it's going to cost at least like 800. Like that's one of my, I mean, maybe even more. I don't know. So I called the Honda dealership and asked them how much the parts would be for everything that needs to be fixed. And it was $950 for all the parts. Also, I'm just going to itemize things and be like, which is more important? Can we do that? Um, just, you know, whatever is more of a safety concern. Um, but yeah, so that's the whole issue with the car. Um, all those things need to be fixed on it. And yeah, it's just like you cannot count. I, me and Daniel were talking about that in like yesterday's vlog, where it's like I just cannot catch a break. You know, it's like even though I, I, I know I, I pray, I, I'm, I'm thankful. God blessed me. He gave me a few sales yesterday, like big sales. So thank God that had happened because at least now I have a little bit of money um, to to fix a car with, but. You know, I, I I don't know how much it's gonna cost. I'm guessing from past experience, like in the eight hundred to thousand dollar range, and I just do not have that. I have to itemize and save. And this weekend, if Daniel and I don't go garage selling, I'm going to focus on sales, 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 taking new like listing, like taking everything down marketplace, relisting everything, taking new pictures, just busy, busy, busy with that because um, I need a total refresh. When things are on marketplace for too long, it gets stale, people lose interest. So if you just delete the listing and then take new pictures, better pictures, relist it, then it gets pushed back to the top and people are gonna see it. They're gonna like the picture, they're gonna buy. So, and I wanna thank the people who did buy from me. You really, really helped me um, in my dire straits. Um, Ivanya, Carol, Lisa. Also, Lisa gave me a $15 Starbucks gift card. So thank you, Lisa. I really appreciate it. Mars, all of you uh, purchased from me. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And you guys got a deal and you'll help and you'll miss Philly out. But yeah, um, I'm just going to a few thrift stores just so, you know, maybe I can find something to resell, but I'm not gonna stay out too long. Their bag section is dismal. Nothing good for me anyway. And I looked in the um, showcase and there was nothing there either. <sighs> Buy eggs. Oh, I didn't see this coat. Ugh, look at the handles. No wonder it's here. Grotesque. Hmm. If I could somehow fix, take the handle strap off. Oh wait, no, there's corner wear too. Never mind. Ne pas jiki. That was French for gibberish turn the car off it is hot today guys it is a hot a biatch today being fat and being hot is never a good thing in conjunction with one another <laughs> but, um okay so the only thing that we found thrifting today was okay a pair of these i've been looking for these forever we paid like four dollars for them for my uh, rock band set i don't have any drumsticks so yay to that and then we found um i've been trying to find this movie to stream for a while but i found it on vhs it is house sitter with steve martin and goldie hawn this brings back a lot of memories circa like 1993 because i think this movie was released in 92. okay so it's steve martin goldie hawn house sitter the tagline is she came she saw she moved in 
I remember watching this on Super Channel. If you're from Canada and then you were a kid in the 90s, you remember if you had Super Channel, uh, I think it, it, it was kind of like our version of HBO. Like it was like a movie channel that you had to subscribe to and you needed like a cable box. And pretty much uh, when you got that sh like uh, channel, you were like the bomb.com because you know, you weren't like welfare. <laughs> um, I remember this is one of the premier movies when we first got it. And um, I remember watching it as in an 11 year old and I was like, oh, and I remember liking it as an 11 year old, but I haven't seen it as an adult in a long time. It's basically Goldie Hawn, which I love her so much as an actress. She moves into Steve Martin's house because he built it. He's an architect and then he got divorced. I mean, his girlfriend dumped him so he couldn't move into the house. So it was empty. And then Goldie Hawn is like some, you know, person that just squatted there anyway can't wait to watch that thank goodness i have a vcr player so excited to watch that and the only other thing that we got was like a ton of these i paid forty dollars for one two three four five six i think six or seven of these um like this one is chima it's like a book and then with legos in it and then this one is like uh, ninjago uh one two three four five yeah seven of them this one is Ninjago Master of Spinjitsu. This one is Star Wars. This one is um, Castle, Lego Castle. This one is Lego City. And the last one is uh, Star Wars. So, I mean, we so for $40, you pretty much paid like 5, 10, 15, 20, like $6 a piece ish. And maybe I can sell each for like 20. Bitch, you dream I don't it. know. I just took a gamble on them because I know Lego sells very well, but I don't know, you know. I just kind of literally took a gamble buying them. Yeah, so far that's all that we got. Um, I'm probably going to just run a couple more errands if there's a thrift store nearby i'll probably stop by and um yeah i'm still trying to get this whole car thing sorted with my mechanic he's being kind of like weird he's not like i asked him like if he could fit me in and he's talking about how he's good with his hands so i don't know what's going on there um i went to i bought these from dollar dollar trama i love this mix doritos cheetos some chips sun chips and pretzels oh I'm a sucker for that. And yeah, that's all so far that we got, guys. Anyway, guys, I hope you're doing well. I'll probably um, end this here. And then if I have more clips, I will add them periodically. If I don't have any more clips today, there'll be some tomorrow. But um, I'll see you guys in the next scene. So I spent a lot of the day relisting every other taking pictures of all my cameras and relisting them. Went to Starbucks too. I realized that these batteries are not good. Like they are cheap, they're like a dollar, but um, some of my cameras will not like take them and they will say like low battery. So these ones are $2 and these, one are, these ones are better. The platinum power, I think compared to like super heavy duty. A lot of my cameras are saying, when I put this in and it's fresh out of the package, it's saying low battery. But yeah, so these are the ones I have to get from now on. Mm -hmm. I have some over here too. These are the ones that are all done. These are all uh, listed and done. Um, yeah. These two are Daniels. I listed for him that one. And it's an Olympus. Oh, here it is. <laughs> There, we'll put both of his in the front there so I know that those are his. And these are all mine. Loki Pokey Bear. Loki Pokey Bear. Um, I just finished listing this for a hundred. And yeah more stuff i want i need to get organized i got so much stuff in my room like i have those bins i have this i have that over there i have all that crap over there i just need to get more i just i want more space in my room like these chairs take up so much space too 
I listed them online for a thousand dollars. I know. I had to put the other one over there because I have no space. I have like so, I don't even have that much space that like all this stuff is <laughs> over here. I need to get rid of the brass. I should have accepted the $200 I was offered it. I was aiming for the stars when I listed it for three. Should have taken the two and now it's sitting. This thing, yes, you can see me. This is what happens when you're fat. <laughs> I'm like, clapping, clap, clap. There's that thing, there's this thing, there's, yeah. Then I have this here, this wicker thing, I'm just doing laundry. And then I have these two chairs that are also here taking up space. You know what I always notice too is that no matter if I dust every day or wipe down every day that like I get it gets so dusty still like all the time. I mean I guess because I have my window open so it's like all the dust goes in but it's so annoying. And it just looks ghetto and it looks dirty. I hate dust so much. I should have kept my air purifier the one that's heavy duty. But I sold it for good money, though. There we go. The best thing I ever spent $20 on. <laughs> okay. There. gaming for a bit, but I don't know. I mean, it's fun, but I feel like I have better things to do than freaking game. 